Hello everyone and welcome back to Night Ghost 49 as we play Banish the Colonial Charter The Forge Awakens 1.8 edition or 1.6 excuse me um, so this other the video before this has not gone up live so there's no comments to actually review so we're just going to jump right into things we do have a traitor a traitor no a traitor we do have a lot of tin ore here um, no actual refined tin which is unfortunate so I don't know if I need to buy anything from this guy right now how is this fishing dock doing? I bet you it's just yeah, it's just bringing in the fish. Holy crap, it's bringing in the fish. So this episode, we're doing okay on food. I've got a few things just rolling. I'm going to assign more people as builders because, geez, we have a lot of jobs. But I think I need to address some dry storage and maybe some efficiencies that we have, or issues with efficiencies that we have uh, with people where they're living and working. So let's go into storage. Um, let's look around. There's a dry dry goods storage. I think I'm going to go ahead and just build one of these on this road. One for the traders, and then also, you know, we've got we've got the foundry here. We have Joyce being built. We've got these stockpiles are completely full. Basically, we need something else to help these guys out. Now, with all the additional uh, workers that we need, part of the issue right here is I don't have 10 to finish these jobs, and they're four builders apiece. So there's 16 of those right there. Now, our bakeries, we're going to do flour, but I wonder if we can do anything else. Maybe one of these, we should do bread, which is flour and butter. And then we could also do flour and cheese. Hmm. Sugar cookies with flour and sugar would be delicious. Everybody would just, like, lose their dang mind. Um, maybe cheese bread. And then we'll do that. We'll get two people working those. We are going to have probably some issues with getting those all stocked up and ready to go. And actually, right now, let's go ahead and run through... To make sure everybody's jobs are nice and close. If they aren't, we need to address that issue right now. Okay, that's too far away. That's close enough. These guys should be good. That's too far away. That's too far away. All right, perfect. So we do need more housing in here, and I think I'm going to build those up around this area. Now we are stopped by fancy uh, homewares and things like that. Oh, I'm silly. Copper, copper ore turned into actual copper, and this tin turned into actual tin. There we go. We'll get those going, too. So let's build some houses over in this area. Um, should we connect them on to here, these colonial half houses? They're just so freaking cool. I don't know what I want to do with this yet. I, I think I think this look is really fun, and uh, I want to do something with it. So maybe, maybe I'll build some housing down here, um, or maybe just on the other side. I, I've got all these plans I wanted to kind of mess with over there, but maybe not. No, like, let's... Building supplies, colonial house. Um, you know, since I don't have fancy furniture yet, let's just go ahead and remove this. We'll, we'll get the supplies. I know there's some stuff there to pick up. But let's go ahead and let's start messing with the... Where is it? Where's the leveled housing? That would be fun. Well, we've done the leveled housing before. Maybe I don't need to do that. Maybe... The half houses. Okay. These are all the half houses. And then there's another tunnel house as well. Which is just so freaking cool. I love it. Uh, let's... Should we do another tunnel house? Maybe we should, but let's do a row of something else in the middle. Um, Colonial Corner House. Oh, I can... What? We're going to do, like, a little closed-in subdivision. Okay, this is what we're going to do. Let's do a half house. Let's do a corner house right here. And, um... We'll do another half house over here. And then a corner house on this side. Alright guys, we're going to let that finish and we're going to do something in the middle over here. Now keep in mind, I know that we're, we'll encroach on this a little bit. I don't want to I don't want to mess that up at all, but we'll, we'll just see how it goes. Now we could get a few more people working these copper mines and all that good stuff. So I think I'm going to go ahead and add another one person for each one of these. Oh, is, is our pasture open? <gasps> it is. Holy crap, this is going to be good. We need sugar. Sugar cane, sugar cane. One, two, three, four, sugar cane. I think we're going to need rope, too, so we might want to start making some hemp. If I'm thinking about that right. Uh, but we do need these houses to be done. Flour and cheese. Yeah, I don't... I was worried about that. Let's just turn that into hardtack. Yeah, the butter. Uh, let. Dang it, we're just all going to have to do hardtack. I don't have enough cows. I don't have enough Frisian cows yet to support that. Now, look, our warehouse was finished. It is looking very nice. Uh, this one needs to be finished as well. I would like to actually finish a couple projects though. Now we are doing 10, so some of these may oh, look 3 out of 10. 
3 out of 10. Ah, there we go. Okay. Um, I'm going to pause this one. I'm going to pause that one. Now, we do have a pestilence here. I'm going to try this. Oh, snap. Look how much food we bought. <gasps> That's awesome. That's awesome. We're doing good on food. Let's check this. Oh, wait. That's the second trader. Where's the first one? There we go. Flax. Um, I don't know what we have. I'm being a little lax in actually getting all this stuff. Oh, do we have grapes? Now, grapes would be really good. And that's going to be because of wine. I've got grapes. Okay, I don't need anything that guy's got. I'm just going to let him sit there. It'll be fine. Now, let's go over here. Let's try this. All right. So, we've got a disease. If we say... Oh, it's auto-saving. There we go. If we say... Get out of here. And then we say reclaim. And then we say work. <laughs> it does work. Okay. Well, there we go. Um, I still think that's a little cheaty. But dang it, that does work. That's awesome. All right, we'll give that a go. <laughs> that's cool. All right. All right, that's fun. Um, nice. All right, let's see. Are these homes being finished? Oh, they are. They're getting worked on. Very good. I want to do, do a check over here and make sure everything's being worked like it's supposed to be. This is going to be worked. Um, oh, we need to do an orchard. We need to do some grapes. That's what we really need to do. Let's get some dense orchards. We'll do it on this side. We'll do a little vineyard area over here. I wonder if that... Does that stand true for... Um, that probably does stand true for farms. If they get a disease. Oh my gosh, that would be so good. It's good because it's incredibly difficult to deal with. Is that only seven deep? Really? I feel like that's very odd. No, it's 18, right? Okay, I'm done. Never mind. We'll just do two. So we're going to clear those. Orchards take forever. They take a full year, or two or three years, to actually, like, get fruit on the tree and making sure all that works like it should. So we're going to have to wait and, and see how that works out. How is the sheep doing? Yeah, we're making a lot of food. That's good. That's real good. Okay. So like I said, this, this episode, I wanted to work on some supply lines. Making sure people are being efficient with uh, where they live and all that good stuff. In fact, I want to finish off all these houses. Like, let's go. I still don't have a graveyard. I don't know if I really want to put one in. To be honest, I don't know how necessary it's going to be. It does help with happiness. If I was role playing this a little bit more, I would say it's absolutely needed to help with disease. And I don't think the game factors that in, or I would make that a higher priority. Okay, so we've got some people that moved in. This one was finished as well. In the 20s, late 20s, not the best, but you know what? Uh, we're, we'll deal with that. It's fine. We can handle that. And I think I need to put in... Let's do some roads right over here. We can do roads in the middle as well, which is so cool to me. I love that they've made so many of these uh, production buildings so we can put roads through them. It's just awesome. It's just too freaking awesome. I can not handle these. All right, so these are going to get finished up. Now, how are we doing? We've got nine ten out of there. So who's going to make the Ren 10 10 joke when I've got 10, 10 to actually, you know, finish that? Oh, there's fancy homewares right there. You piece of garbage. I needed those. That's okay. I don't, just don't know if I want to buy any of this stuff. I can, I can kind of start making it. I don't know. Now, there is the whole section with pewter that we're not dealing with right now. So, um, like, like this homeware supplier, we need the fancy homeware with with uh, fancy furniture and pewter. We're not doing anything with that right now. How are we doing on flour? I just saw that, and I want to check because we're probably we're probably cutting down on the flour pretty hard right now. Yeah, we've taken away a thousand. Um, how are we doing on wheat? Because I would like to start turning wheat. We've got a lot of wheat. Okay. Let's go ahead and put ourselves up another area to, to grind up the food. It's right here by the bakeries. It actually makes a ton of sense. Let's go into food, process, and large windmill or a small windmill. That large one. That thing's legit. All right. Let's build it. Let's do a large windmill. Look at that. All the houses are done. Nice. Wait, what is this? Upgrade to a seamstress to create cloth for people clothing for people wait really is that just the corner houses what okay i'm gonna have to mess with that okay the meat tinnery is complete that one's gonna be finished up here soon um nice okay okay so what they take it like we could do fish oh my gosh we could build like a million of these 
Just for meat. I didn't even think about that, guys. It's not generic. It's very specific. Wow. Um. Wow. Should we take in the fish? I guess we could. Are we smoking fish right now? <laughs> what do you smoke? Yeah, we're smoking fish. So maybe we won't do that. Because we're using the fish currently in an industry. And I'd rather not split it. <laughs> Except that there's 5,000 fish right now. How is this thing doing anyway? There we go. Okay, this orchard's going to be done. Uh, it's ready to go. I'm only going to put two people on it because, honestly, like I've said before, it takes forever. They, they just take forever to work it. In fact, I probably won't even work this yet. I need to make sure we're building up and we have enough families going. So I need to focus on housing. Food's doing all right. I, we need to focus on housing. Um, let's do that again. Let's see. Noble Rambler said, I don't have enough homes for the amount of families that I have. I, I could easily make another 40 homes and we'd be good to go. So we're gonna do our little project here. Let's unpause this one so that any of the tin that's being produced will be put in here as well. Because this tin is finished and that's gonna be finished up. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, let's go to housing. Um, nope, 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 that's not what I want. Now, I think I'm gonna do the tunnel house. I would like to actually have like a little bit of room in between these so you can see them. But I don't know how much is enough room because I would like to what if we had a little community in here? Like a school? Oh my gosh. Do you know how cool that would be? Like a little market? And a school? <gasps> this has to happen. I'm sorry. It just has to happen. Colonial townhouse. Half house. Ha what, are the, what are the difference between the ha townhouses though? Are there any difference? They're, they seem to be bigger. A little bit bigger. Um, corner house. Wait, what is this? Corner area. A decorative corner area does not flatten the ground when built. Let's zoom in. Okay. So it kind of puts a little end on this. Not the most useful at the moment. That's alright. Let's do these. Let's do... Let's do two half houses and then we'll do... That's what we'll do. Uh, we'll, we'll do the tunnel house. Okay, there we go. You know what? I've made a decision. So one two and then let's go with the left one over here because it's the left side and i'm sure that's exactly how this makes sense i don't think it does but that's okay we'll do two of those and then we will also build the tunnel house so that we can have a way to walk in between these oh my gosh we could do a well in here and everything <gasps> i'm i'm thinking now i'm thinking with suburbs <laughs> hashtag wrong portal reference all right let's go ahead this is going to be for wheat let's get uh let's get two people working this Oh, you know what? It, the extra one went over here to this oats guy. I'm going to go ahead and reduce that because I don't want two people working. I only want one. I only want one. There's a bakery making some hard tack. You don't have hardwood? I'm sorry. I thought we were producing a lot of hardwood. Like, I was stockpiling it. Very little fancy furniture. We have, like, no hardwood. Uh, I'm sorry, but... I mean, I know that these kind of fluctuate quite a bit because they take longer to grow and whatnot, but that's kind of ridiculous. Oh, I forgot to select this, so they would just pick it up. Okay, someone did die of old age. That's that's no good. We got 800 sugar cane out of this. Okay, so the spirits, the distilleries are going to be doing just fine. Yeah, yeah, they're doing just fine. I wonder how we're doing on furnace fuel, because I did add in the copper and the tin production without actually reviewing that at all. We're still doing okay, but we need to kind of keep an eye on that. All right, what do you have for us? There's spinach, grapes. We have grapes. We're good to go. I believe we have cotton. Cotton would bring us an entirely new industry. I think I've already purchased it. We just haven't tapped into it yet. Yep, we've got cotton. We've got hemp, um, flax. Haven't touched any of those as of right now. Um, not gonna, not gonna fret over that at the moment, to be honest. So whatever. Looks like our bison are growing. Uh, beef cows. Are producing beef? Beef. There we go. They're producing beef. It's all good. How much ore are we getting out of this bad boy? Yeah, about 40-something a year. This is going to take candles to upgrade, so that's good to know. How are we doing on... Oh, it does have a remaining. Is that from the little bit I... That must be from the little bit I actually mined. Weird. That produces quite a bit of tin, though. 
All right, that guy's good. This guy, dang. Okay, we're just we're just getting the stock has been just pulled out of here. Not all of it though, right? Because we do have some pea coats left over, which is good. But pottery spirits. I'm gonna pull. I'm gonna take the wool coats out. I don't think I have anybody making wool coats because we're doing the pea coats, but uh, I don't want that being pulled anyway. Plus, I don't want it as, as something just sitting there, you know, as a distraction. All right, you know what? Let's actually take a look at our clothing industry and see if we can increase uh, that whole thing. Let's look at wool and leather and see how we're doing. Look at the llama meat we have. Dang, we need to make that. All right, where is where is it? Flowers looking good. Uh, Hardtack's looking fantastic. Got a lot of hide coats. Why do I have a lot of hide coats? How much leather do I have? I know it's right here because I'm seeing lumber. Somebody's going to face palm on me, aren't they? Lime, lime, like oh gosh, it's, it's right there. One thousand. Okay, how about we? How are we doing on wool? We're doing great on wool. So us switching the industry has actually helped out quite a bit. Okay, good. Let's find, um, let's find every tailor that we can. In fact, those corner homes we could we could convert those. Man, that's some really good efficiency if we did. Okay, um, not jointer. Where are you at, my friend? Not preserver. We do need a roper eventually. That's that's going to be something we need to jump into. Where are you at? Taylor. There are four jobs, three locations. One. Thank you. We know we're doing peacoats there. Okay, this is the one. Oh, you're still doing hide, you sorry sack of garbage. You are going to do peacoats. That's right. All right. Wow, we're doing really well on food. Did this dry storage thing get finished? It did. All right, there we go. We got a little extra spot there for some things to get moved over. Okay, now I said, what did I say I would do? I would, I would check on efficiencies and things like that. Let's go ahead and unpause this so the tin will be finished up here. This is going to be some massive food production, but I'm going to let that sit for a minute. Houses are being finished up. People are moving in. This is this is really good. Um, I do want to kind of plan this out. Put a well in there, maybe school and some other things. How are we doing on the flour? We're making some good flour. We're making some good hardtack. Now, here, here's what we need to look at again. Where does everyone live? Are we being efficient? Or are people having to like take the non-existent mass transit wagon system, right? And uh, having to go every which way. Okay, that's a little further than I would like, only because we have houses right here. So I might address that. Bakery, very good. Butchers, doing well. Um, I think that was it. That's the only industry we have here, except for the blacksmith. Okay, so we're, we're doing all right, but once we get the tin operation going, that might be a bit of an issue. Okay, hardwood. Let's buy some dang hardwood. Um, let's buy some tin just to finish that thing off. There we go. Anything else? We could buy some fancy crap, but I'm not going to do that. Okay. I think spirits were doing okay. Pottery. We do need to check on pottery. Let's let's sell some pottery. And then value of tin. If we sell seven of those, there we go. We're good. Let's check on the supply chain for pottery and glass. Let's do that this time around. Okay. First off, we'll look at the inventory. We're going to look for clay. 5,000. Okay, we're doing fine there. But how's the pottery looking? So we'll run all the way down to the bottom. That little pottery icon actually helps. We're doing okay on pottery. We have extra. We have extra ready to sell. Not as much as I'd like, but we have extra. Now, let's look at sand. How are we doing on sand? Uh, sugar cane actually popped up by 1,000. And we're into the spring. So that one farm is going to do just fine. They're going to be able to produce a ton of stuff out of that. Sand is at 1,000. Um, let's look at glasswares and glass. I think that's all we're using the sand for. Yeah, glass, we've got a little extra. Glasswares is looking awesome. That's great. You know, we could do a preserver if we made a raspberry farm. Ooh, you know I'm about to put in a raspberry farm right here. My raspberries or strawberries? You know what? I'm going to pause it because I want to make sure this is right before I just go into it. Um... Where's the preservers? The, the, where's the preservers? Oh, Saints preservers. Um, dang it. I don't know. It doesn't tell me. I think it's strawberries, guys. Like strawberry jam. Yeah, I think it's strawberry jam. Let's put the preserver over here. Ho, ho, ho! We've got nomads! Uh, my bleeding heart. <laughs> How many guys? Is it like 50? Oh, it's like 57? 
<laughs> you know I'm doing it. You know I'm doing it. We were able to take only 17 of those guys. Okay, that's a little bit of a problem. If we can't flex like that, like that's kind of an issue, right? Boarding house. That's the old school boarding house. But I don't have one yet. We should just put one over here. Right up against the, uh, the apiary? No, there's something else going on here. Is that a road? I guess it is. Shame my first rodeo. Let's put in a boarding house right there, and then we'll do some more homes in this little this little subdivision, right? Oh, we need to we need to get this working. Okay, let's think. We're gonna need a lot more food now. Holy crap, it's gonna be crazy. Let's get a couple more people working on this one. Alright, so fruit. I don't really have a lot of fruit, do I? Okay, never mind that. Uh, soup, tomatoes, leeks, squash. Is there squash? We have a lot of squash. Wheat, really? I don't want to mess with wheat because I want the I want the uh, flour supply line to be fine. Kale, ginger, really? Ginger soup. Well, that would actually have a use for that completely useless item. I mean, it's used in like herbal stuff, but ginger. I don't even have a lot of ginger. Furnace fuel's looking fine though. Huh. We have a ridiculous amount of milk. We're going to make a dairy now. I get distracted constantly. But here's my thing. Here's my thing. If I don't address it right at the moment I see it, I will forget about it forever. <laughs> you will not see me address that darn thing for 10 years. You know what? Let's just put a dairy right there. Oh, it's going to be awesome. We'll just do one dairy. Because you can actually work through milk very quickly. All right. We're not going to do... No, you know what? We are going to do fish here. We... Yeah, we're going to do fish here. So, let's just say we're not working these for the moment. Vegetables. We do have squash. Oh, wow, none of those. Okay. I'm going to have to look at the food and actually make those. Th these are going to be really good producers of food, I think. All right, let's get it. I don't know how much tin we have. Like, not even the slightest idea. But I really hope it's a lot. So it is using the remaining section. Okay. I've got a bit of an issue with that. And I should tell you why. Because I don't think I should do that. They're visiting the doctor. The doctor is actually very close to them. Isn't it? I think the hospital is right around here. Which reminds me I should probably build a hospital over here. And I could put it in here. Oh yeah. Look at that. That's perfect. Let's do a hospital in there. I love that quaint crap. It just makes me happy. All right, look, see? Yeah, they're in the hospital. There's still a lot of people who don't have homes. We need to we need to finish off some more houses back over here. Um, yeah, we just need to put in a bunch of houses, don't we? I don't I don't need to make them look super pretty. Um, this is this big old monstrosity is going to help. But let's put in four more houses right there just to help out in that situation. And in fact, let's go ahead and increase priority here so that people will actually work that. Oh crap! The stockpile is almost full too. Um, dry goods, or should I just do a magazine? Ooh, you know what? A magazine would actually help out a lot. Here's the preservist. Oh, saints for of us. Strawberries, glassware, and sugar. Oh, frick! We don't have any sugar. Okay, well, you know that's something that we can look at. Freaky for frick. Uh, we could put in another butcher though, because we did see that we have a lot of lamb, or not lamb? Excuse me. Uh, we've got a lot of the llama, so we can put that in as well. We just need to put a lot of people to work. I think we're still doing fine on schools, but I, I might put another school up in our little subdivision up in that area just to make it look good. Uh, we do need food. Food's an issue. I guess we can just do grapes here. It just takes a couple years for that to like actually finish off, and, and to put that much time into it just for food and not for actual production kind of irks me a little bit. Wait, can I use fruit here? Strawberries, where are you at? Yep, strawberry and tin. You know what, let's work this and put two people there as well. So we're going to be tinning fish. 72? We barely started the dang thing. That's amazing. That might be OP. 24 bison. Let's check on the bison. Alright, we've got 11 there. How many do I have here? We're maxed out over here. Could purchase them. I really could. Do I need them? I don't really need the leather. The food's always good, right? Like, let's be honest. Plus, bison meat is delicious if you've never tried bison. Hello, it's good. Much better for you than beef, actually. 
Got them fat cows. All right, let's get this built. Let's go, guys. I might, I might build up another um, forestry area. Yeah, I need to. There, there's no, there's no getting around that. I think it would be very advantageous to do that. Um, I'm gonna overlap them a little because they still produce quite well. So let's do that, and we'll do the hunting cabin as well, and then we're gonna put in the forestry, the the forester, I should say, hardwood no, bamboo tree forest. Hmm. So some somebody did ask a while back, and I did answer. These palm trees and the bamboo trees, they don't, it's just a visual change. There's, there's no other change. I like using the new trees. We can do the normal for, forester so I can show you that as well. Um, it'll clash a little bit with some of those new trees. over. You know, actually, it will clash with, with the new trees. I don't want it to do that. Because they're kind of going to be fighting each other, and that will cause a bit of problems with the AI, I believe. So let's put in a road there. Let's put a road in over here. Perfect. Okay. Oh, these homes are getting finished up too. Very nice. Must be doing okay with lumber. Alright, we're bringing in a ton of food. Is this stockpile almost full? How's this thing looking? That's looking a little full too. We're going to need to build that up some more. Um, but this... Oh, this magazine. That magazine's going to help a ton. Yeah, it's going to help out a lot actually. I don't remember. Does the magazine hold stuff that a stockpile holds? That'd be good to know. Yellow fever. Yikes. Where? Over here, there is actually a doctor really close. So those nomads brought two diseases. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. You're at your own risk if you bring in those people. I'm going to actually employ as many people as I can at the mines because we have so many excess. I don't want them to um, kind of throw a fit. Are you considered a preservist? They, uh, the smokehouse is. That is very interesting to me. Uh, let's increase that to two and get somebody else working that. That's really cool. Huh. As you can see, we are not keeping up on um, we're not keeping up on tools, which is not good at all. So I'm going to go and put an extra person here at the large smithy. We may end up needing to build another uh, smithing shop as well. A few homes did finish off, so that's very nice. How are we doing on fuel? Fuel's actually looking good too. I may need to put one over in this area to kind of help out with that. I'm not going to put it over here. We won't put it mixed in with with all these fine little establishments. But, oh, dairy, this is just too good. Let's put another person there. Work it, man. I think I want to put in a well, like, over here. So it can serve all these areas. I think that's not a half bad idea. Um, where is it at? Oh, there it is. Let's do a well. Perfect. Now, I think I should put a courthouse in over here. We need a little bit of justice, right? Um, maybe, you know what? Not over here. This is all my production area. This is where everybody grew up, and oh, where the old castle was. Oh, that's a fantastic idea. I'm glad I thought of that, Night Ghost. Holy crap. Look at that. Bought logs. We're buying all kinds of good stuff. Long story short, uh, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. What else can we make? We could make an old school. What's a gazebo good for? <laughs> what? Okay, whatever. Uh, the governor's house. Fish house collects taxes from... Oh, but that requires fancy furniture as well. So I think I'll just put it in here and pause it. Yeah, we don't need to do that. All right, what did we buy? What did we buy? Nothing, because these guys are selling uh, the other goods. I still think maybe I should have these guys automatically buying stone. Stone we always need. Six people are sick. I have not been paying attention to that. I'm a little concerned that that's still going on. Um, that sucks. There we go. Let's get that stone purchase. Let's actually get that guy out of here so I don't have to freak out about the food. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and cut this episode here. Thanks, everybody, for joining. We did bring in nomads. We're doing that crazy business all over again. And it looks like it's kind of biting us in the butt a little bit in the form of people getting real sick. So hopefully we can overcome this. Uh, I think we'll be fine, but you never want to jinx it when it comes to diseases. So anyway, thanks, everybody, for joining. It's been a blast for me, and I'll see you guys next time. Later.